crab dip that I'm making with Asiago cheese, some sharp cheddar, some cream cheese. I'm shredding about one cup of white cheddar, and I'm all about building flavors, even if it's in a dip. I want to get some of that creamy sharpness from the white cheddar and that nutty richness from the Asiago cheese, and I'm making sure I don't scrape my fingers. Ooh, that looks beautiful. So I'm gonna use eight ounces of room temp cream cheese. If you use cold, you'll get little clumps of cream cheese throughout your dip. You don't want that to happen. A half a cup mayo, a half a cup of sour cream, and the sour cream is gonna add some tanginess that I think works really well with that sharp cheddar. About, hmm, that much <laughs> heavy cream, a tablespoon lemon juice, and that's like half a lemon. Drop in this cheddar and Asiago cheese. Mm, I love the smell of fresh crab meat, and I'm using claw meat because I really want the crab to be the star of the show. It's sweet, and it's gonna push through all the sharpness and the creaminess of the cheeses. I'm getting into this now, okay? I'm gonna add in some seafood seasoning. Gotta add a little hot sauce to this. It's gonna be really flavorful with a little kick of heat. Fold it in, I see, and this is why I said it was so important to have room temp ingredients because look how that's just effortlessly folding together. Okay, next step, transfer it into this one quart baking dish and pop it in the oven. Oh, wow. Mm, 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 mm. And you know what? I wanna add some more cheese on top. Just spread that on top. This looks great. I'm gonna pop this in the oven. I have it preheated to 400 degrees. I'm gonna bake it for 20 to 25 minutes. I think my crab dip is done. Woo, hot mama. Look at that. Mm, 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 mm. The guys are gonna love this. Get into it. How about that crab dip? It's mm -hmm. awesome. Mm -hmm. We're gonna patent that. <laughs>